is we need to select a cutter. So if we come over here and go to our end mill, down cut, then we'll select that tool. We need to enter our A axis degrees. So we can come here and put A axis as zero. And then what is the diameter section that this mortise is being applied to? That is a section diameter of 2.5 inches. So we can put that here in section diameter 2.5. Now, um, this is where we need to apply the size of the pocket in the mortise itself. So we have two and a quarter, four and a quarter, and five eighths in the negative Y axis. So let's go put those in. So we have our X start position, which is two and a quarter, and we have our X end position, which is four and a quarter. Okay. Now we're going to put our Y axis start, which is negative 0 0.625. And we're also going to be putting that in the y-axis of negative 0.625. So let's determine the width, and that is 3 eighths of an inch. So let's go put that here on our mortise width, 0.375. And then our cut depth. Uh, for this demonstration, I'm just going to cut 3 quarters of an inch deep. And so now we can press finish and save. So now let's come down here and generate our G-code. And now let's go out to the machine and watch this take place. All of these cutting advantages are already implemented into this indexing mortise toolpath in Conversational Cam Pro.